Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, ladies and gents, and welcome back to AS2 after two weeks of not recording. It has felt like about a year. But anyway, we are back after the channel reboot, after the channel update, in what I am calling Major Cult Season 2. <laughs> Whether it'll work out like that, I have no idea. But anyway... We are back with AS2 and a brand new mod pack that has come out of the World in Conflict. Now, for those of you who don't know, the World in Conflict is actually a game in itself. And uh, if you have some disposable income lying around, I highly, highly suggest you go and have a look at it. I was absolutely obsessed with it when I first started playing it. So, I'm very, very interested how they've managed to translate World in Conflict into AS2 because they're not, well, they're kind of similar games, but they are not similar games at the same time. Anyway, we'll have a look. We've got more than enough campaigns to go through. So, we're going to start with the top Russian campaign of Aggression, and we have quite a few missions to go through. So, let's get on with it. Now, I will just point out there was a, uh, a video intro to this, however, it was entirely in Russian. And, um, yeah, I don't speak Russian. So, yeah. <laughs> I didn't really see any point in keeping it in, because I don't speak Russian, and I don't think a lot of my viewers speak Russian, nor do I actually have any viewer base in Russia at all, as far as I'm aware. If I do, then awesome. And I apologize for skipping the video. <laughs> now, we have a, what looks like a basic military base with maybe a train line going through it. So, possibly half military base, possibly half like supply depot. Big old place, nonetheless. Okay, so we are fighting as Ukrainian army, I'm guessing. Wow, that's a lot of things that have gotten trashed. Um, we've got a decent number of vehicles. It looks like we have a workshop in there. Um, ammunition. We have fuel. I think pretty much everything we could, like, yeah, everything we need. Awesome. Oh, who's this coming in? Okay, that's slightly confusing. Three camo trucks without any people in them. Okay, they've got people in them. Okay, so I'm guessing if we've got any objectives. Okay, just the captain, senior lieutenant, and radio man must survive. Okay, we'll have to find them first of all. I'm guessing this is some sort of defense mission then. Where are they all buggering off to? I need them. Okay, so basically skipping through what just felt like about an 18 hour monologue. Um, basically a bunch of troops have uh, dismounted within the base. We had an armoured vehicle that took some troops out to, uh, to this location. And... It looks like we're now fighting US forces? I... I guess? So I think... I th as far as I can work out... I think we're USSR forces, or Soviet Union forces, that have taken over a Ukrainian supply base, and we're now going to defend it from the Americans. I think that's what I understand. Great. Nobody told us about it. Oh, good job, bud. Good job. You flipped your Humvee over on a rock, haven't you? Yep, yeah, nice one. Nice one. Very nice one, indeed. Do we just leave these guys here, then, or do we do we try and attack them? 
Um. Oh my. <gasps> okay, maybe we're not in the Cold War because those are F 35s. Um. Anti air. Possibly. Or not, you know, whatever. <laughs> oh, wow. Okay, then. Maybe not. <laughs> oh, we have something else coming in. Oh, hello. We have some infantry fighting vehicles coming in. <laughs> now, as far as I can tell from this mod, it's good. Don't get me wrong, it's good. However, it doesn't really work on the World in Conflict format simply because there is no vocals on the uh, on the cutscenes. I mean, even even some really really poor voice acting would have made this better. But regardless, we are going to uh, going to continue and hopefully we'll defeat the American forces that are trying to attack our own base. Are they actually, are they going to drive through the walls? Oh my god, they are going to drive through the walls. Oh, Christ on a bike. Um, right, okay. Um, we need some... Infantar. Bloody Nora. Ouchies. There you go, that's how you get them. Right. Let's take these chappies and go and kill this guy. Okay, and we have infantry pushing through those gaps, right? Let's get these guys on a defensive formation. Take your time, boys, you know. It's not it's not as if there's a war going on or anything. Good job! Nice one. Right. I would get in some form of cover if I was you. And uh, let's try and conduct a flank. Get us in the up with those chappies. Let's do a flank. God, these guys run so slowly. <laughs> Wait, holding? Oh, they're holding. Oh, we've also killed quite a lot of them. Oh, they have a sniper. Huh. That's slightly concerning. Oh god, they have reinforcements. Oh, dearie, dearie, dearie. They have reinforcements. Oh! Wait, oh no, there are, that's uh, Armata, isn't it? Isn't that an armata? I'm really confused because they have like <laughs> they have modern equipment in what's supposed to be a in what's supposed to be a like a Cold War game. <laughs> I'm <am> really confused. <laughs> um, yeah, something tells me we should probably retreat from there. Look at that 
Jesus. Wow. Okay. The uh, the US military have really pulled out all the stops here. Can you like pull back a bit? I'm going to clear up this right flank. I don't like infantry being in my right flank. That's a tank. Run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. <laughs> oh, fuck. Everything's just getting flattened. Oh my god, I'm getting flanked. Bloody Nora. Ah, that's not that. That's not a very good defense line, is it? Yeah. Right. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh. <laughs> that was so confusing. <laughs> oh my god. That was so so damn confusing. I don't even. I couldn't even work out what was going on. <laughs> we just got swarmed. Oh my god. Right. Well, okay then. <laughs> I, uh. <laughs> I guess it's on to the next mission then. <laughs> So ladies and gents, as there is many, many different campaigns and missions in this um, game overhaul mod, I will create them in an entirely different playlist to my normal AS2 and uh, I will try and structure them as best I can so that we get a variation between all the campaigns. But as always ladies and gents, thank you very much for watching, thank you very, very much for your support. And I will see you on the battlefield.